Uh, let me ask you first about the morning. It was a busy yes. morning. I'm sure your pager went off early. Uh, this was a, a, a search situation, a warrant. Uh, there, was, there was somebody at local authorities were looking for, and uh, it unfolded in dramatic fashion. Yes, we had um, a person that we had been looking for for some time. Uh, it was a fairly recent homicide that occurred this year. And we had a warrant, and um, our regional task force, um, they're very, very good. Uh, they typically are the ones that go after our really high-risk uh, homicide cases, and they had been looking for this person for some time. They located him this morning, um, and uh, when he exited the, uh, the apartment over 77, uh, the unit block of K Street, over by 77 K Street. Once he exited the uh, apartment, he just opened fire on the uh, task force officers. So um, they returned fire. He was killed in the incident. Um, so is tragic. This, is this a mix of officers from from around the region? Does everyone sort of contribute to the task force? It is. It's a uh, it's United States Marshal Service, uh, Metropolitan Police Departments. We have representatives on there from multiple police agencies, uh, Metro Transit. So they're all deputized. They work for the region because a lot of our homicide or really high risk violent criminals travel around the region. So um, this allows them to go in Maryland, D.C., Virginia. The, and these are people who are presumably in motion they they they're aware of their status and they're they're constantly on the go and it's it's chase 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 yes and it's very dangerous i mean uh we've had uh, officers in this task force shot um in fact my first year uh as the chief i responded to a sim very similar situation to this one where one of our task force officers on this team was actually shot uh in the face by a suspect they were tracking so um dangerous job and uh, this team is very good it's, it's sad sad ending um we don't ever want anybody to lose their life, but um, you know we didn't have any officers injured, so it's very early in the investigation. From what you know, did this unfold uh, as it should have? If you if you sort of get well, where I'm going, well, it, it is very early, but I'll say that you know that sometimes there are um, people who just make their mind up that um, when it comes time to confront uh, this person, knew that they were wanted on a, on a homicide and um, had been avoiding uh, police. They knew he was wanted, and sometimes people just make their mind up that they're not going down without a fight. So, um, no officers were hurt. No officers were hurt. So that's good. Thank God. Yes. Yeah.